Yes, it has been reported that radioactivity was identified on the West Coast, and it's speculated that this is the result of recent events in Japan. It's not unexpected that we could measure this radioactivity because of our extremely sensitive means to identify it that we've developed in order to protect people. What was, uh, what was measured was less than one thousandth of the federal limit for exposure to people for an entire year, which means that what they were exposed, what could, you could be exposed to from this is extremely small. And we would expect some variations in the, uh, in the near term from one day to the next, but it's not expected that this would last for an entire year. Remember that we have radiation in nature, and it's something that, uh, that we live with and, and uh, is a natural part of our life. But clearly, what has been identified on the West Coast is not harmful.